In today's news, Biden drops out of the race. The Dems said, quote, we could smell this coming since the debate. Some others say it smells like coconut rum served from a bartender. In other news, the Republicans are commenting on the proposed gun control policies being talked about in the shadow of the assassination attempt of Donald Trump, stating the Second Amendment is necessary to protect us from a tyrannical government. When the Secret Service was asked why the sniper was not stopped or why Trump was even allowed to go on the stage, they responded, eh, I don't know. Some Republicans are proposing that the FBI and the CIA need more access to our digital footprint to prevent these kind of crimes in the future in the name of freedom. In other news, cocaine sharks are appearing off the coast of Brazil. When the sharks were questioned, they said, we swear we don't know Hunter Biden and this water smells really good. Let's go to Barry for weather. Barry? Thank you, Bad Christian. And if we take a look at the map, you see what's going on over here? I'm not really sure what that is, but it doesn't look good. And then you got what's going on down here. I'm not exactly sure about that. It might be rain, it might not. Tornadoes, hail, snow possible, I'm not sure. Whatever it is, it might, it might not. We don't really know. Back to you, Bad Christian. Thanks for that report, Barry. In world news, Palestine has signed a deal to ease tensions in the Middle East, but Israel was not there. When the IDF was asked about the proposal, they responded, eh, maybe we'll make a deal one day. In other news, it's been reported all across the United States that employees of Wally World are finding human poop on the floor. I guess people just don't want to go to the bathroom. When asked about it, the employee stated, this sucks to clean up. Let's go to Joe for our wildlife forum. Joe? Well, bad Christian, as you can see by over here, bears are a problem. Rabid bears, vandalizing trash cans and bird feeders. Luckily, nobody was hurt in this incident. Back to you, bad Christian. Thanks for the report, Joe. And it seems to me, maybe possibly those bears were on cocaine because this is America, not Brazil. This is fake news for a fake world. We bring you the partisan reporting that is likely, but probably not true. Have a good night, everybody. Thank you.